I thought we shot it to uh, the best we shot it all year long. And it was 10 of 18 until Reggie missed that one there at the end. And Kendall being four or five, his only miss was, a, was one he probably shouldn't have taken. But it was a fantastic job by us in the second half. I was a little disappointed with their defense in the first half. And, uh, you know, they shoot 48% in the second half. We were fortunate they missed some shots too, but I thought our defense was much better. But uh, um, we, were, we were good with the basketball. We, Silly backdoor pass to Johns, and then uh, I told Kendall he must be uh, uh, paying the guy at the stat because that pass that Kendall threw out of bounds 90 miles an hour off of Z's hand, they still gave Kendall no turnover. So Kendall likes the guy at the score table or ever who was doing the stats. But Kendall Marshall was something else. I mean, to play 38 minutes, and uh, yeah, I can sit up here and nitpick all I want, but he was really, really good. And uh, I thought Reggie was really good defensively. Uh, I thought Z and John uh, weren't nearly as effective defensively as they have been, but CJ and, and Richard Howe are good players, and uh, they tried to take it at them in the second half. But uh, we're pleased, uh, to say the least, about uh, how we played. And uh, I got mad at a couple of the three of the subs that we had in there because it's a 12-point game, and then all of a sudden it's a six-point game, and they're laying it up on the other end because we're taking bad shots or turning it over. And so I just made a decision to go with those last uh, 10 minutes or so with the same five starters. And, I'm going to give my guys on the bench some time, but you got to be productive when you get out there, and we were not very productive there, and so we went with those five guys down the stretch. But it's a fantastic win for us. We're extremely pleased. Can you talk about the way y'all exit? Yeah. Um, I think that's just experience, and just knowing when you have a lead, and just you know, and thinking in games how we just kind of let it just go away. You know, you have to be you know slower. You have to think more. You have to be you know more precise with how you you know how you attack. You don't want that three. You know, you can bring it out. You know, pump fade, get a better shot for the team. And uh, I mean, Kendall had a, a night of nights for himself. Your thoughts on what he did? I mean. You know, I was just thinking about it. I mean, they, they played him like Rondo and he scored like D. Rose. I mean, just, just couldn't stop him. And, you know, I think that was great for him, you know, got his confidence up. And I think we're going to need that, you know, later as you know, the season winds down. And, you know, teams are really going to put a lot of pressure on us inside. You did go over 500 assists for your career today. What does that mean to you? You've done it so quickly. Um, it, it's nice, and I'm going to enjoy it till midnight, uh, maybe one extra day this time. But uh, it just means that. My teammates are finishing shots 500 times, <laughs> so uh, I take great great pride in getting my teammates the uh, the ball in uh, situations that, where they can be successful, and uh, that's what happened tonight. Yeah, I mean, I've seen him shoot like this. Uh, I mean, even in the summer, he was phenomenal. Uh, and then he'll, I mean, he'll go out and shoot and he'll hit uh, 10 or 15 in a row. And, uh, sometimes we wonder why he doesn't shoot, but I mean, with his passing ability, he does a great job of taking the shots he needs to. And, um, and then he, when he gets on a roll, uh, you just got to let him go. Would you talk about?